Right, so I thought I'd talk about the Streisand effect because this is something that's been really interesting and it's just popped up on my radar recently and I found it fascinating. So it's the idea, the Streisand effect, it's the idea that when you try and censor information or hide facts from the masses, by trying to censor those facts you will actually help spread them on the internet especially. And the term comes from back in 2003 slash 2004 when somebody photographed Barbara Streisand's mansion from the air, right? And she didn't want that information getting out, so she tried to sue that photographer for $50 million. Uh, and as a result, you know, the photograph was, it went viral, you know, because there's, there's always going to be people who are vigilant in the spread of truth and information on the internet. We don't like to be censored as people, as humans, right? We don't like to feel that we're being lied to or that we're having information hidden from us. Uh, this is fundamentally in our, in, our, in our human nature, right? We don't like to be lied to, we don't like to have deception. Um, so the Streisand effect is a really interesting phenomenon where by trying to censor things, it makes them more public. And I think it's important to realise, especially in the digital age of 2018, and you know, going into the future, this is an age where everybody's connected. You know, there are several platforms that pe that people use today, but they might not be what we use in five years' time or even one year's time. You know, the platform is irrelevant. What matters is that we're all connected through the internet. We all can access information at the click of a button. So the idea of trying to censor information is a very volatile one because if you don't do it right, you know, if you censor something but there's still a trace of it somewhere else, people are going to latch onto that like wildfire and there's no stopping an idea uh, when enough people, or even when just a few people, want to spread it. An idea is a very resilient virus. It can, it can latch onto people's minds and, you know, even just the hint or the idea that something is being hidden from you, if you're in any way curious or critical as a human, you will do everything you can to try and find what that is. What is that information? what is being hidden from you. And although a lot of people tend to spend their lives as being sort of ignorant to what is really going on in the world, I think it's important to focus on finding truth and understanding that the information is out there. Whatever you want to learn, you know, whatever's trying, supposedly being censored from you, the information is out there on the internet and with a little bit of research you can probably find it. It's hard to hide information in an age where information is everywhere. You know, there's constantly new ways of, of connecting with people, new platforms, new networking sites. There's always, you know, it's not just the big, the big handful of sites that we use now. It's not just Facebook, Twitter, or YouTube, or whatever. You know, there are hundreds, and there will be continuing to be more of these sites, of these, uh, of these networking sites, popping up because humans like to be connected. And there's no going back now. The internet is out there. You know, for better or worse and information is out there. So yeah, that's the Streisand effect. The Streisand effect is when you try and censor something and it backfires and as a result you end up giving that thing more publicity than it ever had before you tried to censor it. So it's kind of counterintuitive, like why would you try and censor something knowing that this effect is real? Anyway, that's today's video and yes, I'm back after a short delay. Um, I'm back, I had a couple of weeks off but I'm back on the vlogs now. They might not be daily because I figured I'd rather just make a video when I've got actually got something to say as opposed to just making a daily video and finding something random to talk about. I thought this would be an interesting video, so I've made this video about the Streisand effect. Done.